Ciao baby, Tanepal here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon to never miss an upload. Hi, how are you? Today I'll be bringing you with me for some shopping. In today's trials with Tanya, I'm going to try on some clothes from the brand Terra Nova. Every season I have something I fall in love with. Last spring it was skater skirts, this fall it was a burgundy color, and now it's flannel shirts. And I couldn't pass by this one. I got this grey flannel shirt in an excess size because it's already oversized and I'm not exactly a huge fan of oversized clothes. In my opinion, it looks pretty cute, but it lacks something. Probably a pair of boots and a belt. What do you say? As the shirt is not exactly long and rather loose, I thought that it would be a good idea to wear something under. So I grabbed these shirts. I got them in the smallest size they had, but they were still way too big for me. But over look, they look great and the material was pretty nice. Moreover, they were on sale, so it was a real bargain. I believe this is what a lot of people thought because they got all the smaller sizes. Anyway, I think it's a pretty casual and yet comfy look. I did something under like a pair of shirts, pants, etc. is a great option as you're gonna be feeling more comfortable moving around. What do you say? Here I got some ideas for this navy pullover with a USA print on it. This isn't a lot of brands release a lot of merch with country names, school names, movie names and quotes and many other prints. I have to confess, I kinda dig them, they look pretty cool and casual. Let me show you what I got in mind for this pullover. I felt like this grey pleated skirt would make a great match. 
There was actually another skirt that I liked more, but I couldn't find my size and even this one didn't have anything smaller than an S. The skirt looks very basic and kind of simple and I feel like it lacks something. I have to say, I'm not exactly impressed with the material, it's too thin. And I think you might get wrinkles all over it when you're gonna wear it. And another thing is that it's a high waist skirt and it's slightly too loose for an SS size. The pro though is it's quite stretchy and comfy. I feel like it's a pretty nice match. What do you say? Make sure to check out my blog on my website tatianapaulava.com for more updates and more outfit inspiration. I'm not sure you noticed, but this season, the sweater vest were brought back to fashion. And I have to say that I have controversial feelings. I used to have just one sweater vest when I was little and I was not a big fan of it, but this time I decided to give it a try. And here we are with this grey sweater vest that I got in an S size because they didn't have a small one. It's slightly loose, especially on the back, but with a pair of pants I think it would look okay, well maybe even great. Anyway. I thought it might be a good idea to put it inside the skirt and I have to admit I kind of like how this outfit turned out and I think it looks pretty nice with my Adidas sneakers. So what do you say? Do I look cute or do I look like a grandpa? last pick is this denim skirt that has some glitter on it. Have a better look, it's so cute! The glitter was actually the reason why I wanted to try it on in the first place. I got it in an excess size. I was honestly surprised to find my size because the price is so low. Whoa! I decided to simply change the bottom and to keep the same top. Doesn't this fit give you vintage vibes? I feel like that's something my mom would have worn in the 90s. And I also wanted to show it to you with the pullover only. How do you like it? By the way, if you feel like rating my outfits from 1 to 10, where 1 is the lowest and 10 is the highest, you are more than welcome to do so. Constructive criticism is always welcome.
Thank you for sticking till the end. I hope you enjoyed this video. If so, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and hit the bell icon to never miss an upload. Let me know in the comment section which outfit was your favorite and why. And if you'd like to see more of my content or you're just willing to say hi to me, feel free to reach out. I'll drop the links as usually in the description box below. Have a fabulous day. I'll see you soon. Bye.